2023, Tirembu Shetima ticket is for the lower class. Falake, welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. The lawmaker representing the Kedja Federal Constituency in the House of Representatives, James Faleke, says the Tirembu Shetima presidential ticket is for the lower class. News reports that Fuleke was recently appointed as the secretary of the Tinubu Shetima Presidential Campaign Council. Speaking on Thursday, when he hosted the All Progressive Congress National Integrity Movement, ANIM, in Abuja, Fuleke said the Tinubu Shetima project is for the lower class than the upper class. According to Fuleke, the All Pro- Progressive Congress Presidential candidate Bola Tinubu and his running mate Kashim Shetima will not make promises to Nigeria they cannot keep. The lawmaker said Tinubu would, t- would take Nigeria from a consumption state to a producing one and be the prosperous nation with a fast-growing industrial base if elected. Fanica pointed out that Tinubu and Shitima would b- build a robust economy where prosperity is broadly shared by all, irrespective of class, region, and religion. He said, Tinubu and Shitima ticket is for the lower class and the upper class. If you know them well, you will know that they don't make promises they cannot fulfill. If elected, they will be rewarded for hard work. Both would turn the country from a consumer to a producing state. In his remark, the national leader of the ANIM, Abubakar Sadiq, said the movement would do its best to ensure that Senegal comes out victorious in 2023. Sadiq noted that the group will promote and protect APC's integrity, adding that they will create an avenue for dialogue among aggrieved party members to pave the way for reconciliation. The movement has to do with people. Their major concern is the All Progressive Congress. So we will do our best to ensure that Tinubu comes out victorious, he said. So he's coming out to tell us that um, they don't make promises they cannot keep. Uh, But we can tell that to people who are still in KG or babies who are still in the mother's wombs who did not witness this current All Progressive Congress administration. The nerves, I mean... The, 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 it is the authenticity for um, uh, not the authenticity, it is the audacity for me to come out and say they don't make promises they won't keep. Who are they talking to? Are they talking to people who were given birth to yesterday? <laughs> this present administration, what what be the what is the cost problem now? Not be because they promise we they don't go fee for fee. I be these people then they then they then they, then they, then they, then they why not share? <laughs> so has so much emaciated. Look like a sick so patient. He appears too thin, though the war he managed to appear a little big. Please, the people should not kill that man because of a selfish ambition. Tinubu should go back home and rest. Politics is too stressful for a man that has already been stressed by age and illness. But evil plot, evil plot belly Nigerian politician will never allow him to rest. My dear, we're not supposed to be saying this at all. This is to, They will not see this now. They will take this in the wrong way. What they are supposed to do is to go inside and on that day, your PVC, go go inside. I mean, if you have gotten your PVC, on that day, you come out and quietly cast your vote for your most prepared, preferred candidate. Say no to tribalism and nepotism. Vote for a competent, young, energetic and economic sound person to move the economic forward. All regions suffer today for voting an incompetent person as the president in 2015 because of tribe. We don't want a tribal president again. We need a qualified economics and vibrant young man as president. A 6 year old. An unhealthy man cannot offer anything good for the country. Hardship do not know Igbo Yoruba Hausa. Exactly. We go the same market. Say no to voting tribe is an enemy of development. This man has said it all. Say no to voting because of tribe because it is an enemy of development. All right, on this note we've come. To the end of the news, we say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.